So I have made a few videos already on Outriders in terms of farming legendary loot. I stream every night using said farm methods, but actually guys, which indeed is the fastest? Well, today we find out. How's it going guys? My name's DPJ and if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. And if you like what you see and want to see more Outriders, be sure to subscribe. So I have been farming for days, 60 hours worth people, and at the time of recording this video I have only 4 legendaries. They are indeed pretty rare. Now another point to make is all based on RNG, the only thing to increase chances in reality is to do things faster. So what we're looking for is the fastest method in which you can farm, this will equal a more increased chance of having that loot drop. Now I'm aware of the update which arrived tomorrow which is the 5th of March which impacts legendaries from chess and although I did all my testing prior to news of this patch I've still decided to include the results although after the 5th of March guys legendaries will not drop from chests. So there are four farms people are using right now in the Outriders demo. We have the OG captain, the vanguard captain and the chess farms. Same chest, it's just some people farm 3 while others use 5. Now I will add, if you don't play on the Series X, PS5 or a fast loading PC, the captains are way better for you. It's just on next gen and PC, the chests and loading in and out of that lobby is much much quicker making it more efficient. Now on screen they can see me running all 4 farms, both captains and the 3 chest farm and the 5 chest farm. And although I ran tests for a couple of hours, I don't want to stress this video out that long, so we're just going to cut to the chase. And all my testing by the way is done on the Xbox Series X. So let's cut to the chase people, let's cut to that chase. Running the 5 chests, I could do a full cycle of grabbing them, returning to the lobby and loading back in, in about 2 minutes 27 seconds. Running the 3 chests, I was able to grab all 3, return to the lobby and load back in in about 1 minute 22 seconds, so that's over a minute quicker. The Vanguard Captain, I could do a full cycle in 38 seconds, and the OG Captain, I could do a full cycle in around 37 seconds, so a second quicker. In regards to the captains, and this is important for older gen consoles most, the OG captain is slightly quicker and well if you spend at least 32 minutes farming the OG captain, you will come to a point where you get a whole extra run in. So weirdly, although I didn't think this to be the case before starting this testing, I did think the Vanguard Captain would be quicker, but the OG Captain is actually the quicker method. This is definitely down to how quick you die due to the other ads though. Another thing I will add with my testing in killing the Captains, I was using a common full auto shotgun as I'm well aware not everybody at the moment has those powerful legendaries. Also to add, I was killing the Captains only here. There are other ads with both Captains that can drop loot. But even if you did take that extra time in killing the important ads at both farms, the results would be more or less the same, as the ads with the OG captain are closer together, therefore easier to kill. And like I said, the main reason I feel the OG captain comes off quicker is the fact that the other enemies kill you much much quicker than the ones with their vanguard captain. So if you plan on farming for a few hours people, the OG captain is definitely the better one to use. And come the 5th of March, the OG captain will be the best farm in the game we know of so far. So let's move on to the chests and like I said after the 5th of March this data isn't really important as chests will not drop legendaries. So the chests and while this one was a little harder to figure out but it's kind of the same math that applies here and the results are pretty simple the free chest method is much much quicker. To a point of view being more or less able to grab 3 chests, load out, load back in and grab a 4th chest faster than doing that within the 5 chest method. When I timed it over a 2 hour period, I was somewhat 16 or 17 chests ahead on the 3 chest farm method. So the 3 chest run, when compared to the 5 chest run, is definitely the fastest way in which you can earn that loot, especially on next gen and PC. In comparison on PC and next gen, just after 15 minutes you will already have grabbed 33 pieces of loot from the free chest farm. If you compare that to the OG captain run, you would only get 24 pieces within that OG captain. So it is much quicker doing the chest runs, especially on that next gen and PC. And those are the results guys, the fastest method to increase those chances of legendary loot right now up until the 5th of March is the free chest farm on PC and next gen, but on all the consoles and everything else from the 5th of March onwards, the OG captain comes up trumps here. And there we have it guys, and I hope this video helps you out. If you did leave a like it really helps me out people, and hopefully guys I will see you on that next.
One.